Uh, it's actually a nice little rule NCA uh, kind of gave us this year. Uh, kind of get the nerves and everything out of the way. Uh, a lot of the young guys, including me, were really nervous our first AB, and you know. But then after the first inning, we kind of sucked down and it felt good. And especially after I got that first hit, it felt really good. Yeah, I guess what were you seeing there? It's your first college at bats ever against you know college pitching. Yeah, the uh, it's a little different than facing your own guys and everything. But uh, I was starting off the inning with a new pitcher, so I was just hitting first pitch fastball and I got it and just put a good swing on it and got over the head. Now you've been have you been practicing a little catching this? <laughs> yeah, uh, they actually uh, Maneri's been moving me around quite a bit, uh, just with some injuries that happened and everything. And when Saul went down, he said, "Has anybody caught before?" And I mean, my dad being a catcher, all all of my brothers and me have caught. And uh, I said, "I've caught, but I don't know how good I am." But uh, Chink and uh, Mike have been really working with me, and uh, I caught the other day in our scrimmage, and I did all right. Just so I've been playing a lot of third, short, second, and catcher. Paul said you kind of had some, you know, not as good at bats at the end of the game. I guess yeah. what do you need to work on there? Um, really, the first couple of bats, uh, I was sitting first with fastball, I got it, and then I was sitting breaking ball, and I got that. And then towards my, my third at bat, I was sitting fastball, I was just a little too aggressive, a little out in front, and popped it up. And then my uh, second to last at bat, uh, I kind of wanted to like have a real AB. I was swinging a lot of first pitches, so I was like, let's just settle down, see a couple pitches, and that kind of messed me up a little bit. I'm an aggressive hitter, and kind of waiting, seeing taking two fastballs wasn't a good idea. And uh, but then my last bat against a little puster on lefty, I had to sit back and I battle and glad I get on base and Kirsch had that big knock for us. Do you think this game kind of helped you with your nerves? Yeah, no doubt. Uh, I mean, it's just still going to be a, a little a nerve-wracking in February with 12,000 people uh, coming to games on Friday night, but uh, definitely a little bit. I'm kind of a calm guy, but when I saw all those people, I'm, I'm not going to lie, I was a little nervous, but Hal is a good leader, and he was calming me down in the infield and everything, and Josh and Antoine, and uh, they all calmed us down and got us really comfortable. Obviously, it's a fall ball game. It you know, doesn't go really on the records technically, mm -hmm. so what did Coach tell you after um, yeah, he was like, I mean, even yesterday in practice, he was just like, don't worry about the score because, I mean, 20 pitches, like, innings are going to be called. And uh, we had one inning that we had base loaded, no outs, and they called the inning. So, like, you never know what's going to happen there. So we tried not to look at the score. I mean, you still want to win, but we tried not to look at the score. Just have good, clean baseball. And I think we did that 14 innings, only one error. And then our pitcher struggled a little bit, throwing strikes. But, I mean, we pitched all new guys, and they were a little nervous. So... But their stuff was there, just got to throw a little more strikes. And then hitting, we just really didn't have the uh, timely hits or whatever. And that's what Maneri said, that good teams uh, hitting the clutch. And we didn't really have that today. But that's why you have these scrimmages and fall ball to get ready for the spring.